clinical case. 35-year-old woman with a history of polycythemia, polycythemia vera, presents with an acute onset of severe abdominal pain, uh -huh, massive ascites, and tender hepatomegaly. Laboratory tests show markedly elevated liver transaminase, AST and ALT. The classic clinical triad is most suggestive for which of the following diagnoses. Options are acute viral hepatitis B, acute cholecystitis C, bad carry syndrome, and spontaneous bacterial peritonitis. Bad carry syndrome is it. So the question asks the students to recognize a classic, albeit rare, syndrome based on its hallmark presentation and the major risk factor. Bad carry syndrome, this is the correct option. Uh, so the patient presentation is the classic triad of uh, bad carry syndrome. So what we've got, abdominal pain caused by acute stretching of the liver capsule from massive congestion, ascites, fluid accumulation in the abdomen due to severe post sinusoidal portal hypertension, the obstruction of blood outflow from the liver causes immense pressure to back up, tender hepatomegaly, the liver is enlarged and painful because it's engorged with trapped blood. Furthermore, the patient, the patient has a history of polycythemia vera, which is a myeloproliferative proliferative neoplasm. This is a crucial clue because the number one cause of body carry syndrome is hypercoagulable state, and myeloproliferative neoplasms are the most common underlying cause. The syndrome is defined by the thrombotic occlusion of the hepatic veins, which perfectly explains the sudden severe outflow obstruction. Okay, so why the other options are incorrect? So what we've got? Acute viral hepatitis, when it can cause tender hepatomegaly and elevated transaminase, the acute development of massive ascites is not a typical feature at all. Next, acute cholecystitis. This, right, uh, this causes right upper quadrant and tenderness, but not massive ascites. Liver enzymes may be mildly elevated, but not typically to the degree seen in acute hepatic congestion. Uh, spontaneous bacterial peritonitis, this is an infection of pre-existing acidic fluid, usually in a patient with long-standing cirrhosis, while it causes abdominal pain and fever. It's a complication of ascites, not the primary cause of the acute triad of symptoms described. So high yield takeaway, the acute onset of the triad of abdominal pain, ascites and tender hepatomegaly should immediately make, uh, make you think to body carry syndrome. If the patient also has a known hypercoagulable state, like a myeloproliferative neoplasm, factor 5 latent mutation, or is taking oral contraceptives, diagnose, diagnosis is almost certain. Stay blessed.